so I guess this is my first YouTube video. Um, I don't know if I'm looking at the camera or myself, but oh well. Um, so I'm sitting here on my patio. Okay. Hi guys. Um, so I'm Claire. Obviously, see what's with it. I'm Claire Fessler. Um, Fessler, I say that so weird. Fessler, um, Fessler. <laughs> um, but uh, I've been wanting to start a YouTube channel for a while now. Um, if you follow me on Instagram, you've probably seen my workout videos um, or just my fitness lifestyle that I have. Uh, that's really what I'm passionate about. I want to. I want to change people's lives. I want to change women's lives, especially um, my biggest dream, not my biggest, but one of my dreams I'm most, I'm most passionate about would be um, opening a gym for women only and not, a lot of people think like, oh, for women only. And it's like, no, not for that reason. This needs to be a place where women have a community of other women that can come in and work out or just hang out or go to PT or go to therapy or come to a meditation session and just be with women and have female energy to lift them up and have female, other females and other women to empower them and encourage them to become even better than how they are today and how they were yesterday. And you know, our goal should be to be better who, than the person we were yesterday. And so um, if I can help women do that, then that's, all that I need to do in life and I love that concept and I love the fulfillment that I get from it um, and so that's kind of what I'm passionate about in a nutshell. Um, within that goal comes lots of other goals like providing fitness plans and life coaching and, and teaching people how to meditate and how to journal and how to um, be self-aware and um, I think that I've learned a lot of skills in the last few years that really add to the quality of life I bring and that I share on my social media and so that's what I want YouTube for is I'm just going to keep sharing that stuff whether it be goofy or serious or fitness or me not being able to push the weight that I want to in the gym and showing all my failures like that's what I want to share I just I want to see more of my life and more of who I am and I think this is a great way to do it so um let's see what else can I tell you about myself um, I am a student in college. I go to University of Arkansas and I'm studying kinesiology or exercise science. If you don't know what that big word means, um, a lot of people don't, so, you know, it's okay, I'll teach you. But I am a junior in college and uh, I really enjoyed my cur coursework here, but um, college is hard, yeah. Um, but actually I also, so along with being a student here, I'm also a personal trainer on campus and a manager at a gym here and I love my job. Um, it's great. It's a great environment. I love my coworkers. I love it. It's awesome. Um, so yeah, I manage, um, employees at a gym and I work here and I go to school here and I love it. Um, but what else do I do? What else do I do? <laughs> so I'm a personal trainer. I am ACE certified, um, American Council on Exercise. I honestly could be completely wrong on that, but who knows? I should know, huh? Sorry, ACE. Um, but I got certified for personal training in December of last year, and I started doing in-person training until coronavirus hit. Coronavirus. Um, and then I started doing online programming and writing PDF guides for downloadable workouts like my Peachy Guide I released a few weeks ago. Um, I also launched my website, cbuslerfit.com. Check it out. I'll put it in the description below. Um, but yeah, so I'm really trying to kick off a lot of my brand. Um, not necessarily like a lot of quantity of my brand, but I want to kick off the quality of it and I want to start emphasizing that it is personal to me. Like this is personal. Um, and what people are passionate about should be personal to them. And if the job that you work isn't what you're passionate about, there's a reason that it's not. It's because it's not personal to you. And I do take this personally because 
as a woman, I have struggled with self-confidence and I have struggled with my body image and I, I have struggled with my emotions and my feeling crazy when I have lost emotions. And you know, I've, we've all just struggled with it all. And so it is personal to me because I wanna help people. I don't want people to feel the pain that I've felt. I don't want people to feel the sorrow that I felt or the shame. And I think that it's, it's something you can grow from and it's something that you can learn about and learn how to cope with and learn how to become stronger because of it rather than letting it make you weak. And I wanna show people how to do that and I wanna empower them to show other people how to do that. And so, that's really me. Um, I guess things about my personal side of stuff. Um, I really like dogs. I don't have any dogs, but I love dogs. I love flowers and plants, if you can't tell. Um, these are fake though. <laughs> um, and um, I like being outside. I really do. I sit on my patio probably two or three hours of the day, which doesn't sound like a lot, but with going to work and like sleeping for a long time and then wanting to be in the air conditioning like two or three hours outside is pretty hefty. Um, yeah. But I also, I really like just working out. Like I know that I'm a personal trainer, but I really like working out. I enjoy it. I look forward to it. I actually didn't get to work out today, but um, I really enjoy it. It's something that helps me release a lot of built up emotion and built up stress. Um, it's definitely, therapy for me kind of um but I also like cooking I've learned a lot more about cooking in these last two years of living on my own and I've kind of been self-taught my mom taught me a lot but I kind of just play around with it and see how I want to change it up and um so I've really come to enjoy cooking and yeah I also just like socializing I like meeting new people so if you want to meet me if you want to introduce yourself to me message me on Instagram or comment on this video or text me I mean like there is a way you can find my number but like I'm not gonna tell you how just do your research um, but yeah uh, so it's almost been eight minutes I really didn't expect to be able to record this much about myself but I think I'm just gonna post this video raw I'm just, this is just gonna be my first YouTube video so love you guys thank you for watching if you made it all the way through I really appreciate you if you made it all the way through comment in the in the comments, because I'll know if you made it all the way through. Comment hmm, in all caps, peachy. Ooh, she thick. <laughs> peachy, ooh, she thick. So, peachy, ooh, she thick in all caps. I want to see that in the comment if you made it all the way to eight minutes and twenty seconds. But other than that, thank you guys. I love you all. Goodbye.